in the combine this morning. So we're running pretty good today. Cool, let me meet you on the inside there, Chris. Yeah. Uh, we're calling this corn about 17 and a half this morning, which is a huge improvement from the 20% we were at. I like shelling corn ideally. I really like 18% corn. It just really works good. That's just me. Alright, on the move. Alex will load that truck and then he'll head back west. We'll keep on going. So, just an observation from me. Uh, I am extremely impressed with the weed control that we've got from uh, Acuron. good day just trying not to uh, overrun the dryer at all I know you probably get tired of me saying that Good morning. Kind of a wet morning out, but we we'll go dump the truck, and then we got a load on the grain cart here. That we'll take Dad's got the the white Mac hooked to the uh, tanker trailer, getting ready for uh, burn down for wheat. So he's gonna fill that and get that ready to go this morning. I don't think we'll spray, just get the tanker staged. swinger here if you can watch in the mirror don't even have to get out kind of jumpy there
straight row, so let's see what's in the lunchbox. Looks like we got a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, some cookies, a couple drinks, some Cheetos. Not bad. Taking the last eight rows off of this farm. Up to the last load on the truck for the night. Should be ready to fuel up and move in the morning. Harvest is coming along pretty nicely so far. Good morning, everyone. We're getting ready to go disc some uh, some ruts and some weeds over there where we couldn't plant. We actually haven't planted anything there in the past two years. I'm kind of waiting for the dew to burn off. I got to meet with uh, one of our fertilizer suppliers anyway. Dad's been getting the sprayer all ready to go while we're waiting this morning. Well, if nothing else, we're at least um, gonna loosen up the ruts. I'm really not worried if I kill this with these weeds or not, because we'll spray it. The main thing was that we rutted it up and I just needed to smooth it down. Well, I think we're done with this job, at least right here. Not too bad, just about five minutes. 10 minutes worth of disking. Go we'll see if uh, Dad's about done switching the sprayer over from our 15 gallon acre rate for Liberty to uh, 10 gallon acre rate for Roundup. So right now Dad's gonna fold out his boom and we're gonna try to flush and make sure that water, this clean water comes out all the nozzles nothing's clogged. I'm sure stuff will be clogged because we haven't used the uh, 10 gallon per acre tips in uh, quite a while, but go from there. Alright, we made it to the next farm here. Moving along, opening the field up. trying to do here is uh, last spring we fixed a lot of these washouts we filled them in 
but we didn't get a chance to smooth them up. And so what I'm doing now is just trying to lightly test it and flatten out all the humps that we've made with the uh, dirt scraper, filling in these ditches here. everything on this farm that we needed to. We've got everything about smoothed up and ready. I spread fertilizer on it tomorrow. Dad sprayed it and we'll work it with our airway vertical tillage tool and then we'll plant some wheat on it. I'm hoping to get started planting wheat maybe this weekend. If not then probably next week. Uh, we'll just have to see how the week goes. But, well, this is going to be it for this video. Thanks, guys. Glad you uh, tuned in to watch us. Make sure you uh, hit that thumbs up and the subscribe button. Don't forget to drop a comment down below. And hopefully you come back and see what we're going to do the next half of the week. Thanks.